It's been a part of Houston history for more than 50 years, and today a celebration honoring the Astrodome. And in the past, Abelia, there are about 25,000 fans. Tickets are gone, folks, I'm sorry to say. But you know what? Take a look at our story, because we've got the pictures right here for you. It's a priceless moment for many. Oh, this is really rewarding. I wish my parents were here to see this. Christopher Perez and 25,000 others got the opportunity to go back in time and relive the memories of the Astrodome. This is amazing. This is like going back down memory lane and remembering all the good times and all the different events that were here. Everything from the rodeo to concerts, Astros games and Oiler games used to take place inside the eighth wonder of the world. This is unbelievable just to be back here to see what it looked like. 35 years later, and uh, just the first game ever, first game ever played in here, I was uh, I was on the team in 1968. For years, there's been debate on what to do with the dome that was built in 1965. Instead of tearing it down, the historic site will get a makeover this fall. We need to preserve our icon. It was the first domed stadium ever, and it set the stage for all of the others that have come after it. It belongs to the taxpayers. It's fully paid for. It is structurally sound. So it makes no sense to tear this thing down uh, because then we wouldn't have any revenue generator out here. But before looking into the future, today is all about remembering the past and enjoying the treasure of the dough. This is my childhood area. This is my, this is the eighth wonder of the world. And Bill and Dominique are taking a live look at what was the home plate for the Astros when they played inside the Dome. So what's going to happen next? Well, the project will take about two years, and this will become an event space. It's going to cost about $105 million. And to give you kind of some perspective, where I'm standing right now will actually be parking spaces, about 1,400 of them. And then they want to use this for the rodeo, NRG, and a bunch of other things uh, so they can give back to the city when it comes to generating money. And of course, so folks can t come and take a look at the Astrodome. And I wish you guys were here because it's really cool. I know y'all are from Houston, so you really appreciate something like this. Oh, Reporting you know live it. inside the Astrodome. Sophia Bosley, KPRC, Channel 2 News. My first concert was there, the Rolling Stones, back in seventh grade. We all have that memory. Mm -hmm. yep. Thank you, Sophia. <laughs>